Do what you need to do. This world is run in secret by a highly powerful and ruthless elite. They have infiltrated every aspect of our economy, our culture, and our way of life to further their agenda. I am speaking, of course, about the cows. Yeah. Yeah. That. And that part of it. The cows are ridiculous. They're big and dumb and herbivorous and kind of silly looking. No. Think about it. Where did you get this idea that there was nothing to fear from cows? From 500 pounds of raw muscle, razor sharp horns, and cunning instinct? How did this idea of cows as harmless become so ingrained in our collective unconscious? Still laugh. But we eat cows! And that is the crux of their sinister plan. <laughs> we eat cows. We rely on cows. We give cows all the grass they could ever want. We use more land making cow food than people food. We breed them larger and more muscular because we eat them, because we rely on them. Their power grows day by day. Each burger on your plate is a suicide bomber for future world cow domination. A martyr for the cause, giving up their lives that you remain addicted to a constant stream of cow products. Cows want us to turn them into leather. And why do you think we drink cow milk? They saw that human beings could be a destructive race, but we're also so easy to manipulate. We don't question what we're told. The cows never meddle in human affairs directly. They quietly whisper to ranchers as they sleep. <laughs> Their moods contain subsonic frequencies <laughs> that tap into the brain's most innate desires. But it doesn't take a lot. Once you push a person into a line of thinking, we don't get out, we don't know how. Their so-called owners secure their food, drink, and shelter. Human beings toil without question to support the fattening of the cow spirit. <laughs> and there's no way to stop them. There's no way to know if your desires are truly yours or planted there by this bovine Illuminati. <laughs> There's no way to know if you're a puppet dangling from a sinister hook. We get bombarded by messages every day from cows, through parents and teachers and strangers and friends. You can't remove from your brain the parts of you that have been planted by the cows. <coughs> You can't trust yourself to be free from their corruptions. You can't know what is you and what is the cow. Maybe it's all a cow's plan. Maybe there's nothing there that's yours. I want to tell you that you're more than a pawn. And I want to tell you there are things which are not 